Yo, what's going on, guys? We're back. It's finally here, boys. I know a lot of people have been waiting on this video. They switched up some stuff this year with the created ball player. I made one. Wasn't too happy with it, even though he was extremely overpowered and doing really well. I thought we can fine-tune that a little bit more. Been diving in, and I think I found the perfect one. You can get 125 power left and right, over 100 contact, and he's going to get really good speed. I think you can maybe max it out at 80 once you're finally done there. But I'm going to show you how to get this, the fastest way to get it, then the most efficient way to boost up all your stats, the perks, the equipment, and everything that you need to do this method to get the best created player in the game, boys. If this helps you out, drop a like. If this video you've been waiting on, drop a like, boys. I need all the support. And if you are new, hit that sub button, boys. I've been seeing all the new people saying that these videos have been helping out. We uploaded two, two fun gameplays this weekend. One was like the best gameplay that I've played so far this year. So if you guys missed that, go check that out. But we're going to jump into all this, boys. Hopefully this helps you out. This guy's nasty. Let's do it. Derek Jeter. It's Derek Jeter. No, we found some really cool builds. You can you can build a bunch of really cool players in here. This is Derek Jeter. Probably going to eventually switch him to Notorious Scone. But I just kind of wanted to make this Jeter here just because I saw this option. And this card is going to be so good. I, I want to show you kind of where I'm at right now. Show you what i can get to and then i'm going to show you how we did everything okay so right now this card that we have right now is the tool shed and you can see right here you can see right here all his stats look really really good and that's without all his equipment boosts and everything let me show you what this card looks like in game real quick like i said i am not done with this card but i'm already delayed on this video i wanted to get this video out a lot sooner than i'm getting this out right now so i'm not 100 percent done with it but you can see right there 116 power versus left 112 power versus right contact 109 contact 105 89 vision and i know you see the speed right now 58 there's a reason for that right now hold on don't worry and fielding 59 i know you're a little worried about that you can get those up a lot like i said i really was flying through this because i just wanted to make sure it was all going to work out see how it all played out see how he was hitting and then we got to fine tune all the other stuff so i was really trying to speed through this maximize getting the ball player and the archetype up to make sure that i wanted to put in the grind to get the other stats okay that's the big thing archetype parallel like getting them all the way through the program and then actually grinding the stats and i'll show you what i mean when you actually go in to diamond dynasty and you go to your lineup right here okay and you go to the actual card just like years before they they don't upgrade it so even though we have gotten him to diamond Still shows as the bronze every position he's going to be in there as a bronze 65 basically what it is if if you can't find your guy if it is primary position you want to go to that position and then he's going to be a 65 overall right there there's jeter boom and he is going to be in now when you look at the card here in this screen this shows you what you have left to grind and what you have left before you hit that cap, that high cap. Every one of these stats can get to 50. Every one that is not a 50, which is basically every single stat, letting me know that I can grind more. Meaning that the stats that you saw that I just showed you in game with that like 114 power and everything, 108 contact, the 58 speed and fielding, none of that is anywhere close to maxed out. Right here, you can see my fielding at 35. I can get that up to 50, meaning that I'm going to get 15 more on my fielding, right? I'm going to get 13 more on my power versus right hand. I'm going to get nine more on contact, five more contact versus left. I'm going to get 14 more on vision. So I'm going to be able to add all of those on top of the stats you already saw so once again remember plus 15 fielding remember plus was it 17 speed i don't think you can see it. it's 33 speed right there so plus 17 speed 
plus the power and everything and then once again let me show you once again plus all those stats on top of what you see right here so that speed's gonna go up 17 on top of the 58 58 plus 17 the contact's gonna go up power is gonna be able to hit that 125 we're gonna get 15 added to our fielding also that's gonna be able to help out all those little stats to really fine-tune it obviously you can see the hitting's really good but you can get that power maxed out we can get the contact up even more get the contact like 115 114 depending on our equipment fine-tune a little bit more with our cleats and our socks and our speed and our glove and be able to get that stuff up so let me show you everything all right there's lots of different things obviously if you're going to be starting a new road to the show and a new character you're just going to want to go here manage create a new ball player we can see we have the notorious scrum that we tried out and then the jared dare jeter right there you want to create a new ball player if this is going to be what you want to do you're going to pick the contact archetype there's fielding there's power and there's contact you want to go with the contact archetype the first one that you're going to work on is going to be the slugging spark plug okay once you get the bronze slugging spark plug max that all the way out you're going to get this silver slugging spark plug once you max that out you will then get the gold you want to switch to the tool shed is the one that you're going to want there and then your goal is the diamond tool shed so once again you're going to go slugging spark plug to slugging spark plug to gold tool shed to diamond tool shed is going to be where you want he's gonna have all the tools in the shed see how that works once you maximize everything because he's a contact build your perks that you're gonna put on this are gonna be power 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 and power you're gonna want power one two three and four as all four of your perks to put on this obviously your guy's gonna have a ton of contact already this is going to help you get the power power perks and all the gear you need is going to be enough to get you the 125 power you do not need a power guide to do it other things you want to do before you start your road to the show you want to make this as easy as possible things that i would do is i would go to stadium creator and i would download blank canvas that is going to be the first thing that you do very 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 short field high elevation very easy to hit home runs and just absolutely dominate on this field so once again blake canvas you're gonna want to just go to the vault and then it, it, it's pretty much usually in here uh, as the most popular ones in there if you usually go down and search or you can probably just search blank canvas there it is blank canvas this is going to be the one that you want to download okay you can just search for it blank canvas make sure you have this and you're going to activate to all this to your stadiums i'll show you how to do that in a minute but that's gonna be step one get blank canvas next step you want to go create vault there's a lot of different options here you want to tab over to roster uh one thing that we did see is there's a bunch of different things obviously there's the phillies roster and a few things that gomes and the other people are using there but if you actually go here and then search search and then just type in road to the show rtts there is a bunch of them that come up here phillies rockies um there's some other ones in here there is a yankees one right here that works out really really well especially to start off a four-year road to the show shortstop or second baseman if you want to do that there's royals in here phillies with no jt rilamonto if you're trying to do the catcher and he keeps on getting traded off of that because he keeps on getting traded off the phillies a lot so download yourself a custom road to the show roster that way the team you're on is going to be the nasty team and all the other teams have zero overall stats okay that is going to be the big thing right there um the one i went on was the yankees put myself on the yankees obviously if you download the phillies roster make sure you put yourself on the phillies if you download the yankees roster put yourself on the yankees roster okay this is going to help you out once again all your teammates are going to be stacked and all your opponent's teams are going to be horrible it makes it super easy like zero overall stats on everything you're going to go to road to the show you're going to uh obviously when i clicked in it it went to another one um if you're going to be starting a new one you want to hit more options on it start a new road to the show right there which would start you a new road to the show make sure you load the rosters that you just selected and downloaded whether it be the phillies or the yankees or the rockies or if you found something else there and that's going to load you in and then once again make sure you select 
and tell your agent you want to be on the team for the rosters that you downloaded okay once again you're gonna go into your ball player make sure all the stuff is here like i said you're gonna be starting on the bronze slugging spark plug now you hit x on this screen this is going to be your program as you can see i'm already maxed out a hundred of them the only missions that you're really going to be wor worrying about right now are going to be plate appearances hits and extra base hits okay these things the one hit all that was like the, the repeatable missions the only thing that really matters in every one of these games if you're trying to speed through this as fast as possible once again i'm going to show you the speed way how to get them all the way up and then the fine tune way okay you can do it all at once if you're not in a rush you don't need to speed through it but i'm just showing you the fastest way to get your guy to diamond then once he's diamond then we'll turn some of the other stuff back on to boost his uh his fielding and his speed and all that kind of stuff so right now once again 15 plate appearances the 10 hits and the extra extra base hits are the only thing that you're worried about so you are in your road to the show you have your blank canvas downloaded you already started and loaded your new road to the show with the rosters that you downloaded you got your bronze archetype up there first thing before you play is you're going to want to go to league over here stadium assignments and make sure that you set every stadium every stadium to blank canvas okay you could start off with double a if you want to do that and just do double a when you get moved up then go back and do your triple a and then if you get up to the majors then change that but you want every single stadium to be blank canvas not just your team stadium all of them to be blank canvas okay easy enough settings key settings here okay gameplay you can run it on beginner if you're just trying to get this done as fast as possible hit the home runs and that kind of stuff beginner if you're playing events and rank seasons and br and that kind of stuff and you're really worried about your timing and everything i would just still keep it on all-star i did a lot of my road to the show grinding on all-star just because once again with the blank canvas and the rosters it makes it very very still it makes it super easy just to tank home runs like crazy okay you might have to take a few more pitches but at least the pitch speed takes stays the same and it's still very very easy to hit all the home runs you need on blank canvas so rosters blank canvas you can play this on all-star so it really doesn't change too much there okay now presentation you want this on fast play that way it just skips all the other cut scenes and different stuff like that that's going on in the game okay then you want to go to more specific here and you want to turn your showtime off this one doesn't matter too much but showtime off if you're trying to do it as fast as possible okay then you want your opportunities on none and your opportunities on none you have to remember that you did this we turned off base running opportunities and we turned off fielding opportunities letting us know that we're not going to get anything to help us boost speed or fielding and that kind of stuff when you get doubles and you stretch out like longer hits you get a little speed boost there but the base opportunities is really going to be how you're going to boost your speed and your fielding opportunities is going to be how you boost your fielding plus all of the training things that they give you also in between all the games so when it backs you out of a series and you maybe have like a training appearance or something like that i want to see if it's going to like give me a training appearance here or something maybe but you know what i'm saying like going to the batting cage or that kind of stuff those things are going to help you so once you have your contact and your power already up make sure you're doing the fielding drills make sure you're doing the drills to help you raise the stats that are not at the 50 of the cap okay now you have your rosters downloaded you have your cap set up you got everything going and it's just super easy you're just gonna go into the game you're just gonna load up it's gonna no walk up to the plates no fielding plays no running plays it's just hit 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 and you're just going to fly through it that's why those missions are the only ones that matters because it's just about your plate appearances it's just about your rbis your extra base hits and that thing as you progress and this just makes it super super fast for you to do I didn't switch obviously i i moved up to um triple a and i got traded it didn't change all my fields and stuff like that so once again make sure you're just on blank canvas and doing everything correctly and of course i'm just sitting here talking just trying to show you how to do this but my point of showing you how to do this is how 
fast it goes see just right to the player right to the player you want to make sure this is what you're doing once again i got traded to a different team so i'm on the bad team the the, the roster that i was using wasn't working if you get traded while you're doing this there's nothing wrong with just starting over getting a new uh taking the same guy you were working on and just starting a new road to show if you're worried about getting traded I wasn't worried about it because I just wanted to get this video out as fast as possible but once again you see how fast I am flying through this right like it's just super super easy the other thing that you want to make sure that you're doing is when you're done with the game you really don't want to play next game you want to exit out of the game okay simulating doesn't work I'm just showing you this as, as you don't want to go to play next okay you want to return to the clubhouse and the reason being is if you got XP and XP and you reach the program stuff, it doesn't reset. So you want to go out of these games, especially if you got XP and rewards, because it's not going to account everything at the same time. You just want to make sure that it is counting all of your stuff in your program, your hits, your your hits your put out your play this there whatever you're doing so right now with this guy all i'm worried about is extra base hits hits and then plate appearances now since i've already got to the diamond archetype and i'm trying to get the other stuff i'm going to turn my fielding back on i'm going to turn my stealing and uh base running opportunities back on that way i get those boosts to my speed and my fielding because once again those were super super low pretty easy right download the stadium download the roster contact road to the show guy okay you're gonna start off with the um the bronze archetype of slugging spark plug then you're gonna go to the silver archetype of slugging spark plug and then gold tool shed then gold tool shed okay power one two three and four and then your equipment I don't have all my equipment maximized. I know Jackie Robinson Day is going to be coming out. There's going to be a bunch of stuff there. Plus, I'm still grinding through all this. I did spend a bunch of stubs to do this video. Like the video. I did spend some stubs on this video just to get some other equipment. So you can just really see the visual of how good this card is going to be. But just look. I do not have the diamond glasses. I got the gold sleeve there. We do have the good ritual there. Got a gold wrist one there. Got the diamond one there. Got the diamond one there. Got the diamond bat there. I need better socks there. Cleats I got, which you could get better cleats also. That's fine. Shin guard I can get a little bit better. These don't matter too much. I can boost my glove also, which is going to help me with my fielding. And then some of these other things that can kind of help me out a little bit. But I mostly got all that stuff there fine-tuned. The only thing left that I have to do now is grind the base stats got him already all the way up and you can see he was crazy power crazy contact but that's how you're going to fly through this blank canvas custom rosters the tool shed archetype is the one you want with contact on all of the power and this is going to be your guy this is going to be your guy we're going to be able to get him to 125 power left and right like 114 contact left and right like 80 fielding 80 speed he's gonna be good he's gonna be really good let me know if this is the move i don't think you're going to see a better created player than this i could have put him at second base could have put him at shortstop i'm moving a bunch of different things i'm hoping that he plays okay at both positions we will test out all of that i will get you gameplay here soon i want to work on getting all of his stats up his speed and his fielding and really max out this ball player boys but hopefully this helps out everyone ready to appreciate you guys we out Yay!